What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. And there's been a lot of speculation kind of going around over the last month, kind of talking about a Halloween event coming to Red Dead Online. I was really thinking we might get something, but now I'm not so sure. We still may get an announcement tomorrow. Of course, tomorrow will be Tuesday. We'll get the weekly news wire tomorrow. So we could have some type of announcement tomorrow, but it's almost the end of October. So if we're going to get some type of live event in game, it's going to have to be done very quickly. Now, the reason I thought they might do something like this is because of the interview they had about a month or so back where they talked about they were not looking to put out DLC quickly within the game. They wanted to do things slower than they have done in GTA. So I was thinking if they're not going to put out a lot of DLC, a lot of new big updates, maybe they would start doing some kind of live events in game. And I think that would be a very good way for the game to go because a lot of people have started to finish their roles up or have had their roles finished for the last several weeks. And I've seen a lot of people already saying they're bored with the game. I've seen a lot of people in forums. I've seen a lot of people even on my YouTube videos say, now that they have these roles completed, it's just kind of the same repetitive thing. And I've talked about that myself. It feels very repetitive uh, over and over. When After you have completed all three of these roles, you know, every day you're going back out and doing bounties, doing stuff for the collector, doing stuff for the trader. And it's still just kind of monotonous after a while, and people kind of get tired of that. So hopefully, I was really hoping that we would get some type of, of maybe system that would add live events. I really think that would be a lot of fun. Um, also, they could kind of implement the battle uh, or the battle pass or the outlaw pass. You know, there's other games that have this style system. Of course, Fortnite, Apex, uh, Call of Duty's uh, Battle Royale, Blackout had this style system. Now, while you know you have to purchase the you know premium kind of pass with the outlaw pass, there are free items as well. It does not take that long, in my opinion, to get to level 70. You can do it pretty easily. Now, it does end in around the first week of November, so we don't have a whole lot longer left with the Outlaw Pass. But I was hoping they would do some type of event and tie in some type of rewards like other games do, like I just you know discussed those type games. When they have a season going on for the Battle Pass, they also have events that go on. And during those events, you can unlock different skins, different you know masks, the different all kinds of things, different clothing items that... I think Rockstar could really follow suit with that. If they're going to have a Halloween event, you could have things within that Outlaw Pass that unlocked that were, you know, maybe a new mask for your horse as a Halloween-style mask, or maybe just some cool-looking clothes, or, you know, just all kind of things they could have tied into the game with a Halloween-style-themed, I guess, you know, week or weekend, just for something for people to do that's going to be a bit different. Now, there have been zombies spotted on the map in different places. I'm sure most of you have heard about this. Some of you probably have seen them. But a lot of people thought that it might be them kind of testing something for a Undead Nightmare DLC later on. There's been a lot of speculation, too, that they could be just glitched out and it was not supposed to be in-game. I was kind of hoping, and this is just a theory that I'd read, and I was kind of hoping this would happen. I do not think this would happen at all. But I was kind of hoping they would start slowly adding these zombies into the game over time. And then all of a sudden, you know, within a Halloween event, within a, a certain week, you know, like this week or, you know, kind of going to this weekend, there'll be a lot of zombies just kind of around in the free roam area in Red Dead Online. You know, something to have to fight, something to have to deal with, maybe some different missions they could have added in. And like I said, something to do with the Outlaw Pass that they could have added stuff to kind of collect during this event, uh, you know, kind of along the way. So I was hoping it was going to be something like that, unless they really change things up in the next few days. It does not seem that's going to be the case because... I have not heard any more reports of zombies being spotted on the map anywhere else, you know, besides the, just the few locations that people have already seen them. But I was really kind of hoping for something. I, I don't know. I guess it's just kind of that optimism. You know, I'm, I'm looking forward to what Red Dead's going to do in the future. But with these slower updates, it, at the same time, it kind of gets you frustrated of just waiting to see what's coming next. And I was really hoping with, you know, GTA, most likely the new GTA game going to come out next year when the new consoles come out next holiday season. I was kind of hoping Rockstar would put a lot more focus on Red Dead Online and Red Dead Dis Redemption 2 in general for the next year. Uh, because once once GTA comes out, who knows what kind of updates we'll get for this. I'm sure there'll be a team left to work on this game. But at the same time, they're going to be wanting to work on you know their new GTA game as well in the online mode for it that I'm sure will be in there. So guys, leave me a comment. Do you think there's going to be a type of Halloween event? Are you looking, or would you like to see just events in general added into the game? Do you think it would give people enough to do to keep them playing all the time? Of course, guys, if you like the video, make sure you hit the like. If you have a chance, make sure you share these videos. It helps out the channel a lot. Of course, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. Click the bell icon up in the top right corner so you know when all my videos go live. 
and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace. 